guys it's me Lawrence here today I would like to show you guys how to make um, channel arts on your YouTube channels by only using the tools you already have on your computer if you already have a word office and if you're using a windows for sure you have a snipping tools so first thing you need to do is log in so when you log in click this uh, profile pictures on your right side and go to your channel and you see that uh, art channel if you would like to change that you got you have to click look on the right side there is a camera sign there and click that and here you go so you can upload photos your photos gallery so so I because I don't have that uh, ready right now I will show you guys how to do that and it's already on your computer okay first you have a Microsoft Word or Office Word Open that, open the Microsoft Word and click blank, click new document. Let's close this one, my previous work. So there you go. If you have already pictures you want to use that, you can do it. This is like a blank one. So you can just insert pictures then click pictures you can uh choose online pictures so you if you want to find online so click that if is a stock image you have already or on this computer so this device is if you have ready pictures on your device click that so we'll open so let's go look right here so i have several pictures i want to use over here okay how about this i wish i pick this one any pictures you want guys okay it's yours art think about that this photos if you don't uh, customize this it's hard to move around so um i really like to do this um if you click the pictures so i'm going to use behind text i really like to do that this is more easier Earlier you see it's hard to move around, but now it's I can easily to move that around, okay? And I can resize this is the way you want it, the way is perfectly, okay? So I can move that around and now I can do the text trending, okay? I'm gonna make the trending, trending. Now I can resize this text I'm gonna use the biggest text and I can choose a different font so I can use this one if I want that so I would like to do that and then I can uh, customize the text what colors I want uh, usually I pick over here but um, you can do anything over here outline might be choice on um, what colors do i want so let's choice yellow and if you want highlights you can do that but i don't like highlights for this one i have to highlight this before i can take the highlights okay no colors so I, you always have to when you're editing the colors guys you have to make sure that is highlighted and I would like to pick different colors uh, dark blue and then I would like to get the shadow let's pick the shadow here you can do whatever you want there's so much on uh, words you can customize this shadow Okay, I would like this one or we'll use that shadow. You don't have to do that guys, that's it's up to you. I just wanted to show you guys what else you can do on Word. Okay, Microsoft Word. And then 
Okay, and reflection. I would like have some reflection. Yes. Okay, I would like this reflection and then oh, what else and you can put some glow glowing okay so here's for this one if you don't want any colors reflection here you can do you can do here you can pick more you want and for glowing okay I lose that so reflection so I'm gonna take my own okay it's over there so I can uh, pick my own color I want so I might be I'm going to the uh, if you cannot find any color share you want you can always click more colors then you can just make your own so you might be want that one Okay, let's try that. Bright colors. Um, too bright. Okay, let me do something else. Uh, more colors. More colors. Or you can custom right here. Okay, I like that, I guess. Okay, let's see. Hmm, too girly. Um, so it's just it's up to you guys what is uh, preferences you want. So you can always change that, or yeah, right here you can just go ahead and um, uh, or maybe this one green and well, again it will not work if you don't highlight that you have to highlight that so let's see present right here okay maybe that one it's not too much but let's find something else color uh, Okay guys, maybe I will just go ahead and use this one. So if you want to customize some more, there's so many things here you can do. You can do materials, contour, depth, bottom level, 3D format, so you can do that. And then let's go move this text over here. Move this first and pictures move over here. And now click the, clay, uh, click the text. And then I'm going to put this on the middle. So it's right here, guys, on the top. You see that this is the tools you can use to move around the text. And also you can use the space bar or the back. Um, again, I will put that on the middle. And now when you, if you want that position there in the middle, just go ahead adjust the pictures because the pictures is easier to move around just click that clickable and move you can move it around okay so i'm gonna move that over here close to the text and also guys again you can add multiple pictures okay example you can add more pictures let's go find some different pictures you can use a shape as well so but um, i'm gonna use this time pictures so i just want to show it to you and i would like you to explore because onwards uh, is there is so much there you can use so let's try to make it to use this um money this is just showing to you guys you can use multiple pictures and always remember adjust your pictures for you can move it around so i this is two pictures i'm using right here but actually i just wanted to show you guys you can do that you can put that on the uh, top on the middle on the side or you can put four pictures whatever how much pictures you want or in the middle right here 
and you can do that as well so but right now I will show you guys is only one pictures for a quick one to tutorial so now is that was it so if you are really, uh, if you are satisfied you're ready and you're happy with this look on your arch so it seems like I'm happy with it and I like that let me close this one so when I close that one so you have to make sure it's not look good when it's too far to the text so I'm going to click this one click, keep clicking until you get that that uh, four arrow that's when you can move that around if you don't have that four arrow it will not make that move around so and also that bubble is you can resize that the way it's perfectly you want it the way you want it there So put that on the middle. Now if you say that it's perfectly you want the way you want. Now you can use the snipping tools. Go to the start search, start a search, click that, and just click snipping tools or just S, you will see this as snipping tools. The snipping tools that's you can use to snip or cut that arch. Okay. So let's go click the new. And just go ahead um, cut that the way you want it but cut it wider as much uh, as, as possible don't worry about those sticks you can see that it will hide that okay uh, save that to make make sure you guys you know exactly where you save that okay so I'm gonna save this one for point zero for easier to find this now let's go to that pictures but um, I'm looking on the documents I know for sure I saved that on documents and this album right here and right here so to resize this one the way is YouTube wants you to do it the size it's able to use for our channel I am using the edit it's that is already on your windows okay Edit tools is ready on Windows. So you see this resize. Click on the pixels. And then uncheck this one. This maintain aspect ratio. Uncheck that one. So 1172959, that's not enough. Uh, it's not big enough for the art channel on YouTube. We have to customize this. I will show you guys how you can see exactly what is the size okay this is the size they're looking for recommended channel art size is 25 60 by 1440 maximum file size 6 MB so you have to make sure at least 25 60 by 1440 so let's go to the edit uh, 2560 60 change that 25 60 because that is YouTube channels want the the size okay and then on vertical this is a uh, horizontal size 2560 uh, vertical size it's 1440 so when you put the numbers there and just click okay and there you go and just save this again i'm going to save this as an 0.02560 by 1440 whatever name you put it there but I want to do that it's before it will be easier and I know exactly what I'm looking for so any transparency will be lost if you save this picture do you want to continue just go ahead and click OK it will not hurt you and then go to the uh, to the you know channel art I show you this earlier guys how to go on this uh, page if you forget how to get on this page please go uh, rewatch it and then you will see how to do it okay so here 
Then after that, just go ahead and select a photo from your computer because we saved that on the computer. Now it's right here. This is this is what we make, okay? So click this one and a flooding. So it said, whoops, you are out of space. You're currently using one other person. Oh my gosh. So I don't have no more space on my uh, Google because I download so much already. So they want me to upgrade. No, I don't want them to upgrade because if you upgrade, you have to pay for it. No. So let's go use something else, guys. There's a way you can you can edit, uh, you can delete that. But today I will, I will not bother to do that because that's not what is the tutorial for. I will make a different video for that. But I'm going to use a different channel. Okay, this is one of my channel. If you want to subscribe and check it out guys please uh, check it out and subscribe um that's one of my channel but i'm um, right now because it's not working so i will just show you guys how to do this let's go use on my um daughter all right guys um again click this camera sign and select photos from your computer and here you go click that what we did earlier and there you go so this is on desktop you can see this this is the the look on desktop on tv on mobile okay so you can adjust and crop it but i will not do that right now but let's go and also is you can auto enchant just go ahead and auto enchant and let's go click adjust if you want to adjust that you can resize you can adjust it but i will not do anything about that but now if you're ready you just go ahead and select savings and there you go guys here's we just meet okay trending or i will show you guys how that look look on the right side click that and go to your go to your channel and there you go all right guys that's it for today uh, how to make our channel using uh, microsoft Word, snapping tools edit tools um, edit tools is already included on any windows and also snapping tools as well is all included on your um, windows pc any windows uh, microsoft word some computer uh, came with it some computer not you had you can download if you don't have money to pay for it you can download trial they have a 30 days trial and i will put the link of the uh, microsoft word trial and if you already have that's great Okay guys, it's easy and free tools to use to make uh, our channel. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope this is helpful. If you guys you have any suggestion, comment, anything, tools you use, if would you like to share, please share that on comment below. And I would like to hear from you guys suggestion what the next video you want me to do. And I would love to do that that's it for today i hope you have a wonderful day and stay safe don't forget wash your hand often wear masks if you don't have nothing uh very important things to do in the public area please stay home and see you next time god bless you goodbye